Hey guys, Novi here. Uh, I ended the, right. the video without yeah. saying bye, yeah. I guess. So this is the third video I make on the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 series. Uh, the other one I kind of ended out of nowhere, so. Sorry about that. Yay. I think I only died like one time. I'm pretty sure I only died once. Where am I? But I'm not sure, okay. so. Calm down. Uh, Just relax. Correct me if I'm wrong. You're gonna be fine. I think that's pretty good. Hmm. Is it kind of like the time? Achieved our objectives. Man's always gonna be better than machine. Am I dead now? I think I'm dead. Unfortunately, you sustained life-threatening injuries. <coughs> You're stable, but you got a long way to go. Who are you? It's me, Taylor. I think it's time you woke up, don't you? Look at his face. Did you see that face? That is most definitely the thumbnail. If I sound a bit sleepy, it's because I just <gasps> barely woke hey. up. That's all. Still with us? Kind of. Welcome back. Okay. I'm dead. Taylor. Yeah. Do you know what's happening to you? Whoa. Am I dreaming? Well, let's say you are. Why not just go with it, right? After all, you can always wake up. December 12th, 2054, 7.30 a.m. We're on board a private commuter train headed to the Zurich headquarters of the Coalescence Corporation. Our uh, cargo, prototype for the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. At its core, specialized AI software that's capable of rewriting itself in order to interface with any other system in the world. State-of-the-art stuff back in the day. It'd go on to revolutionize a broad range of military and civilian applications. At least, it would have if the train had reached its destination. Whoa! Okay. We're dead. Okay. At 7.31 a.m., a terrorist group time? detonated an explosive device on board this train. Oh, I'm pretty sure the, 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 the incident set physics. back our robotics program several years. You're here to stop it. This is... It can't be... What is happening? Right now? Right now, you're in a medically induced coma being prepped for surgery. You've got a new bit of hardware inside your head. It's called a direct neural interface, or DNI. I've got one too. That's how I'm able to communicate with you. Your DNI is what connects your mind with your new body and the larger world around you. Sorry, We're connected. my mouth is a bit parched. All of this is a simulation inside our minds. And you got a long way to go. Well, he got really up close and personal right there. <coughs> that loading screen is very trippy. Okay, what the heck? We just RPG! 11.30 a.m. <coughs> December 11th, 2054. Stop time again. Zerg security forces receive an anonymous tip giving them the location of a hideout the terrorists are using. Unfortunately, the ZSF underestimated the firepower these assholes were packing. They got caught with their pants down, and they took it hard. Now it come. Train go boom. You remember Diaz? I think so. Gonna help get you up to speed on some of the cool new shit you can do. Oh, it's that guy that helped save us in first mission, brother. First mission. We all gotta be in sync. Yo, Taylor, you're a fucking dick. 
You didn't hear shit? If I want to talk to you, the DNI transmits on a closed channel. I don't even have to think about it. But, uh, just so you know, if you ever think about calling Taylor a dick for real, brother, he's gonna mess you up worse than those robots. All right. Let's go see if you can do this okay, nice without sir. ending up with Swiss nice cheese sir. like those poor bastards. Okay. Okay. That lighting has changed dramatically. Somebody else is there? Breaking left. There's never just one route. High, low, left, right. Different paths yield different advantages. Your D and I can provide combat critical info to help you better read the battle. I really don't think this is supposed to be here. I wonder what we are in this game. If anybody knows, can you guys can you answer me in the comments? Because I have no clue. Oh, I'm shot. Alright, use your enhanced mobility. It may take a little getting used to, but your confidence will soon grow. Try it for yourself. I got a hundred says you can do it. Users beware. I am kind of sick, so coughing may be a bit loud. Whoa! Uh, let me out, let me out, let me out. Oh, okay. Okay, throwing one of these grenades back. 
probably gonna end up horribly because I'm gonna go too slow. But oh well. I will just die and respawn. Team logic. This new thing that like you see where exactly everybody is is pretty OP. I'm just gonna keep it on because I'm kind of new about this game. So yeah, if you guys want me to turn it off, I'll turn it off and like use it. Just tell me in the comments what you guys think. I'll pick a vote. Just got a little accolade. Look at that gun movement as I'm walking forward. That gun animation is very odd. D and I doesn't just help us communicate with each other. It allows us to interact with a variety of computer systems, including pretty much all the basic drone units. Now bipeds, sophisticated ground units. Those were a whole lot trickier, brother. Those sons of bitches got a damn <coughs> high mind. You try to process and control all that, your brain is toast. But these? These fuckers are easy. Go ahead. Back in. Let's see what's on the other side of this wall. Oh, it fits like a glove, right? That's somewhere through there is the generator. Take it out, and that door should open. happen if I go all the way to the ground. I think you move faster when you're on the ground. There she is. Blow that generator so we can get the side of it. Okay. Oh. Oh, so the thing is a Wait. Oh. I'm afraid the EMP blast from the generator was probably your drum. Come on, okay. let's go. Rick. Can I open this one? No? Okay. Well. Grab fresh ammo whenever you see an ammo crate. Last thing you want is to be in a fight with no bullets. I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Uh, like, comment, rate. Like, like, rate, and comment. And please subscribe. Thanks for watching.